Oh, my stupid broken ass mouse when I started the recording back up. Didn't start back up because. Oh, fuck. Recording overloaded still. Because, uh, my mouse keeps double clicking. Yeah, I know that I have this quest set. Thank you for telling me. Looks better now. Can't stream this one, apparently. Or need to figure out how to stream it. It was going slow as shit. So this one's just gonna be for YouTube, it looks like. Talk to you. No. Follow me around. So you can change your direction while you're on the map, but you can't actually move. It's kind of weird. It is nice that you can look up the people who have quest or important information or whatever the fuck the pink means. The Prince Valiant and your shitty haircut. Talk to this kid. I want to talk to you anyways, kid. Fuck you. Talk. Brilliant. Ah, oh, because that's two handed. Do I have a shield? No? Well, then I'll definitely use that. jump earlier. They could have talked to that kid if I jumped up to them. Humble folk of cobblestone, great land spirits, hearth and home. That's how it goes, isn't it? My granddad's been teaching me the prayer ever since I was little. He reckons the spirit of the land really does live on cobblestone tour, you see. As long as I can remember, he's been preparing me for this day. The day it would finally be my turn to climb all the way up there and offer my thanks. Y'all have to keep blowing the spirit. I just wonder whose idea it was in the first place, sending the village's young folk on such a dangerous errand. What if I take a tumble and do myself a mischief? What did you just well, say? not to worry. <laughs> Since you and me were born on the same day, I'm lucky enough to have a bodyguard along for the journey. Come on then, that craggy old thing won't climb its. Oh. What she said. Oh no, the most dangerous creature in the game. Ah! Monsters! They're coming this way. I'm not a bad slime. Crikey! 
to move around, huh? Don't give up. Go on. Get him. Crikey. Guy Pox. <laughs> Little blighters, aren't they? Crikey, I wasn't expecting Crikey, that. Oh, I know they were only little, but I'd have been done for if you and Sandy hadn't been here to help me. Well, then you're pretty pathetic. Can't beat up a couple slimes, really. And now we've got to go through that horrible, dingy cave. Just our luck. I'll bet you anything that's where those awful things came from. Well, as long as you're with me, I've got nothing to worry about. Come on, let's get going. Oh, that includes that. Alright. A one hand sword shield thing. So all I can equip the whole game is a sword. Or other weapon, if there's other weapons. It can be a hell of a thing. Jump doesn't mean go anywhere. Not quite that. Little blighters, aren't they? Crumbs! Crikey! Don't give up! Get him! <coughs> 
you. It seems to be ATB, but I don't see an ATB well meter. Done. Yay, I can do a spell now. Blighters, aren't they? Positioning doesn't seem to really matter so far. Probably for spell casting or something. For AoE spells. Crikey. We don't need that pony and quest thing sitting over everything. I'm gonna get rid of that. Obnoxious. Oh, hit every button. That's happening. Pot. Woof woof. We're tired that it's not. Oh, it's 12 30. <laughs> Waking up at normal people time. Oh, normal ish. Probably make my way through this dungeon and then, uh, a break. Do you think? Help! Help me! What? Cole? Ah, 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 quick! You have to help him. Me? <laughs> hey, my kid.
Don't they can dodge. Positioning comes into play, so hang out over here. Gemma, I only came up here because I thought it'd be funny to jump out and surprise you. You're a little douche. But then those monsters appeared. What in the world is going on? I never heard anything about monsters appearing on the tour before. But never mind that now. Whatever were you thinking? <coughs> they could have been killed. You take Sandy and get back to the village this instant. Y yes, Gemma. Sorry, Gemma. He says sorry. You saved my bacon again. I knew you were tough, but crikey, you really have grown into quite the hero. I want bacon. Not far to the top now. Oh, typical. It would have to go and start raining, wouldn't it? Come on, let's get a move on. Oh hey, you just fall off, huh? Doesn't hurt though, at least. Here we are at last. Oh. It's such a shame about the weather. I was really looking forward to that view. Well, we better say the prayer and get this ceremony over with, eh? 
yourself. Give me your healing herbs. Oh, it's gonna go Super Saiyan. Close enough. We're alive. But how? That that great big flash of lightning. It was almost like you made it happen. I did. It's called a spell. Look! The mark on your hand! Hmm? Oh, it stopped. Well, we can worry about that later. All I know is that you saved me yet again. I don't know what I'd do without you. Die. Now, we really had better be finishing up this ceremony. Finish your ceremony. Humble folk of cobblestone, great land spirits, hearth and home. Lift your voices again. up in prayer. Shit. Sing it across this all This video is going to be all fucked up. Blessed are we since days of yore. Let it be so forevermore. I've been playing Red Dead Redemption, so it just this view ain't on shit. And on and on. Whoever dreamed up this ceremony must have had this in mind. They wanted to show us how huge our world really is. <laughs> well, that's it. It's all over, and now we're grown-ups. Should we head down and tell Grandad and everyone? They'll all be waiting for us at the bottom. I don't really see all that much of the world, just a couple of mountains. Water. Wasn't done. I want to go and slay more slime. Probably go back in if I really want. I don't.
Well done. We're back safe and sound, Grandad. Indeed you are, my dear. Thank the spirits for that. When we saw lightning striking up there, we got a little worried, I have to tell you. <laughs> well, I never. Sounds like it's nothing short of a miracle that you made it back in one piece. Hey, Windows, how about you done? Pop up random shit on me like that. Well, there's no doubt about it. The spirit of the land was watching over you. Now tell me, my dear, how was the view from the top? The all of the person. It was wonderful. I saw the sea stretch into the horizon and the sunlight playing on the water and. Oh, I've never seen anything like it in my life. <laughs> You're true cobblestonians now. Only we have the pleasure of looking out over the world of Erdria in such breathtaking fashion, you know. You're still young, and the day may yet come when you decide to leave cobblestone behind. I hope our little ceremony has opened your eyes to a little of what may await you out there. Now, it's high time we were heading back. I'm sure your mother is eager to hear how things went, young man. Don't keep poor Amber in suspense. Come on, you. Home time. I really don't need the draconian quest underway thing displayed for the entire fucking game. I know that I chose those. Thank you. Bugging me. I'm gonna turn them off just so I don't have to see them. Smash, smash, smash. Whee! It'll eat. No shopping allowed. Just here to talk. I guess this is where I would shop if I could shop. Here anyways.
Oh, fuck. Right. Busting all up in your houses. Smashing your shit. Why? Because fuck you. I can. Go ahead and tell me about that. Ignore that I just smashed a bunch of your shit. the only animals that can compete with humans for long distance running. Short distance, almost everything beats us. Especially cats. But, uh, long distance, horses. Horses and humans. Yeah, I'll save your kids. Suck my dick. Emma can watch. Prepared as I can be. Exit. Looks like a blocked exit. Thank you. 
was my little soldier. Well, not so little anymore. I've heard all about your big adventure. Look at you, all grown up. I hope he wasn't too much of a bother, Gemma dear. <laughs> of course not. Quite the opposite, in fact. You would have been proud of him. We got attacked by a monster at the top of the tour, and I ended up hanging onto the edge of the cliff by my fingertips. I thought I was done for. But you'll never guess what happened next. That mark on his hand suddenly lit up, and a bolt of lightning hit the monster. What did you say? That funny little mark? Lightning flying about the place? Goodness me. Goodness indeed. Here I was, hoping he'd turn out nice and ordinary, but it seems his grandfather was right all along. Well, I've been putting this off for long enough now. You and me need to have a little talk. Here. This belongs to you. Fancy. Your grandfather asked me to give you it once you'd come of age and climbed the tour. The truth is, there's something I've been keeping a secret all these years. Something I've never told another soul in the village. It's... how can I put this now? Um... well... he said you're... You're the reincarnation of the Luminary! What? Oh, don't ask me what the old fool meant, dear. I haven't got the foggiest. All I know is that your grandfather said you had a special destiny and that there was something you had to do. Fuck bitches get money. He said that when you came of age, you were to head north to the capital, up there in Heliodor, and show that necklace thingy to the king he seemed to think that if you did that all would become clear clear as mud i shouldn't wonder anyway the long and short of it is that if you want to find out what this is all about you'll have to leave cobblestone and head over to heliodor okay crikey <laughs> I'm the chosen one. Well, I can't stop you leaving, I'm sure, but you won't be marching on an empty stomach. Come on, dinner. <laughs> Eventually. That'd be useful if I could wear them. What's up, bitch? I'm gonna miss the south in general. Oh, 
can't sleep either, eh? You remember this tree, don't you? I got my scarf stuck in it all those years ago. There I was, crying like mad, and there you were, running round trying to help me get it down. <laughs> Some things never change, eh? Why, is your scarf stuck in the tree? Do you need help? You know, I always imagined we'd spend our whole lives right here in Cobblestone. That's why I was so surprised by what your mum said today. All the... <laughs> I remember the story my granddad told me. Once upon a time, long, long ago, the world was terrorized by a horrible monster. But then, the luminary appeared and saved the day. When it was all over, the luminary turned into a star, and he's been watching over us from up in the heavens ever since. That's his star, right there. Which one? How can you be the luminary too? I, I just don't get it. I know. That's what you're going to Heliodor to find out. I understand. Really, I do. Listen, we should both be getting back. Everyone will be wondering where we've got to. Goodbye, old friend. Bye, bitch. <laughs> Run, stupid. I'm leaving you. <laughs> well, just look at you. You don't scrub up too bad, you know. Only wish your grandfather were here to see you. You won't forget him, will you? He was a fine, upstanding man, the pride of the village. You could do worse than try to be like him. Well, however you turn out, I'm sure you'll find a way to overcome whatever lies ahead. A mother knows these things. Bitch, you're not a mother. Oh, by the way, I've popped a little money I'd saved for a rainy day in your pack. Don't spend it all at once. Monks, Why don't you shops. visit the village shop before you head off to Heliodor? You'll need some supplies for your big adventure. Are you teasing me now? Well, don't take too long. The whole village is turning out to wave you off. Ugh. Betty grunt. That. That was the one.
more money I can't spend on anything. miss a church. I miss this whole building somehow. Also a save point. Dude. Actually. Hey. Yeah, I think I'm done for the night. I know I just pretty much started, but I don't have a lot of tank in the engine. A lot of tank in the engine. Wow. A lot of gas in the tank. I just say words sometimes. And I wanted to see what would happen if I said that. Saved, huh? That unsaved progress isn't an issue. <laughs> 